Welcome to Staples Center in La... That bell means it's time to start this fight. Marvelous. Can't put two punches together any better than that. Hagler had his name legally changed to include that marvelous moniker. He felt that he was underappreciated by fans and media and reasoned that if he made it a legal name, writers and TV broadcasters would have to at least call him marvelous. He earned it. Two exploding punches. Marvin Hagler with a nice clean combination. Hagler won't last long if he continues to eat combos like that. He opens him up and connects with a booming big shot. He gets caught with two quick punches. Big counter shot rips his opponent open. If you see your opponent's hands tight to the body and face like that, taking small steps forward, then he's probably looking to get way on the inside. That's bully fighting. Nice jab land. Jab combo there. He gets a surprising counter haymaker that pounds him hard. Counters him hard for a resounding power punch. If he's not careful, he'll be eating counters all day. He's just a well-rounded boxer. Good speed, power, great balance, footwork. Nicely executed jab combo by Marvin Hatton. Folks, Duran has nothing but fire in his belly, and it's been smoldering there since he was a kid growing up poor in the tough streets of Panama City. Marvelous found an early opening and unleashed a big combo. Nice fast combination for Hagler. Hagler's flurrying, landing a three-punch combination. Stiff jab lands up top. Hard hook lands and starts off a solid combination. He's able to land a great shot after confusing his opponent with a well-executed feint. Follows up with a sharp haymaker. This is what we expected to see. He goes in with a hard hook of his own. Ten seconds left in the round. Hands of stone. Got to be thrilled with how well that round went. Let's see it again. I don't want any more blood drip. That wasn't your... That bruise ain't looking too. Let's just keep winning. Round number two is about to begin. <laughs> We're seeing a classic power fighter here, folks. Feet planted and set, hands tight to the body and ready to explode. It's almost like he knows what his opponent's gonna throw before he throws it. Counters him in a huge way with a nasty big banger. There seems to be a little swelling around the left eye. Good classic boxing style there. That's the kind of style you'll see in boxing textbooks. Hagler with a forceful two-punch combination. Nice two-shot combo. Hagler counter whacks his opponent. He's playing to his opponent's strength by allowing himself to be countered. Two-punch combination by his flush. Durant with a strong hook of his own. Marvelous Marvin Hagler paid his dues to win the world title. He's made a living traveling to the other fighters' hometowns to earn respect, and in the process, 
beating them up. Hagler displays his hand speed with a series of jabs. What we have here is a living icon of the ring. Duran's been mixing it up with the best of them for over five decades. Oh, his face collides directly with a haymaker. Hagler's taking the best of that exchange as he lands a hard counter. Hagler with a big counter that looks to stop his opponent in his tracks. Good two-punch combo. Good execution. He puts together two nice punches. Hands of stone, obviously leaving himself open to get popped. Boom! Now that haymaker clearly sends a message from Hagler. Marvelous blocks his opponent with two vicious shots. I'm not surprised at all that his warning of an impending stoppage in tonight's fight. If you can't protect yourself, the referee has to do it for you. He's really been beaten up in the ring tonight. He's taken a great deal of punishment, and I think he's right at the threshold. One more big punch, and he's going to be on his back. Hagler might... Come on, fix... You look good. That left eye is gonna... We're not fighting our fight. The third round is underway. Nice jab by Marvel. It doesn't look like there was any progress made on that left eye in between rounds. If that eye gets worse, it could be all she wrote for Hagler. Hagler's tried to jab upstairs. Well-placed combination. Roberto Duran is going to have a short night of work if he continues to eat hard uppercuts. This power fighter may not move like Sugar Ray, but all they have to do is plant those feet, and you better not get in the way of the punches after that. Oh my, what an amazing haymaker from his right hand. Can he see out of his left eye with a nearly closed shot? You know, although he may not have any one outstanding skill, he doesn't have any glaring weaknesses either. He's a well-rounded opponent. Hagler's looking good, coming back with great counters. Hagler's taking care of business, countering effectively and doing damage. Hagler's got great work ethic. It stems from his blue collar background. He worked in construction. He fought, trained in grizzled gyms in Jersey, Philly, all the way up to Brockton, Mass. The more you sweat, the greater the reward. He turns up the heat with that one, really bringing the fight to the side. Roberto Duran's left eye is definitely showing signs of swelling. Marvelous got to realize he's in real trouble now. The ref only threatens to stop the fight when he sees one fighter is in a severe amount of danger. There's no doubt about it that hunger and desperation was driving Duran to fight. He turned pro at 15 years old. Two hard punches crash into their target. He's demonstrating well-rounded skill, capitalizing on many countering opportunities. He's tagging his face with the jab. Just got to make it through these last 10 seconds. When 
without question, I'd say that was a better round for Duran. Duran. We can't send him back out there with his eye looking like that. Wipe off the blood. Take a seat. Suck it up. He's got to be in late. You took it to. All right, here we go with the fourth round. Enough of this. Is this a fight or not? No. Hagler's tagged him. He can see his opponent's punches coming, and he counters with a wonderfully timed shot. A big shot lands. He must have forgotten that you're supposed to protect yourself at all times. Hagler's having real difficulty seeing out of his left eye at this point. Cocked left-handed haymaker pounds him good. He makes him pay for going after him there. He's putting his punches together well. Nice counter. He's looking to take advantage of the other guy's mistakes. Boom, and an overpowering haymaker causes some concern for Duran. He's taking the other guy out of his game plan with effective countering. From out of nowhere, a powerful left-handed haymaker is delivered by Duran. Duran with a hard shot that finds its target. Good execution of that two-punch combination by Mark Hagler. Great one-two combination. He returns fire. He's just got to find a way to survive till the end of the round. He's looking like he could go at any moment, and whatever he does, he just has to avoid getting tagged right now. Good execution, doubling up the jab by Marvelous. after that one. He's looking for his opponent to make mistakes and help him out. Ten seconds left. You can see that he's hurting now. He's sluggish and he seems to get weaker every second he stays in the ring. I don't think he's going to be on his feet much longer. And if he lets himself get tagged with one more big punch, it could... I don't want that laceration to get struck it off. And... That swelling is getting out of. It looks like you got. Let's see how the fighters do here in the fifth round. I don't know how he can see out of his left eye after the brutal pummeling it's taken. It looks like some swelling is starting to form around the left eye. Hagler is going to have to move better if he's going to avoid being caught by hooks like that. Jabs up top, then follows it up with a straight right to the gut. Nice two-punch combination lands with authority. Hagler is showing some swelling around his mouth. Duran's badly swollen mouth is going to be a target for the rest of the night. He returns fire and lands a punch of his own. If you're going to come straight forward, he'll step back and counter. Duran earned a great victory here tonight. He forced this one to an end.
there's no question in my mind that we would have seen a knockout if things had continued.